Good morning, folks. We've got a couple stories to hit today, one in weather and one in the journals on Earth's rotation. But we're going to quickly start with our star, where things are taking a little breather at the moment. The solar flaring has settled into C-class range as larger sunspots begin departing, with smaller ones remaining on the north. We're still awaiting the coronal hole stream here at Earth. It should be arriving later tonight and should be minor. Of course, we'll keep an eye out for CMEs from flares or filament eruptions that do occur, but all in all, definitely a bit quieter day on the sun. Minor plasma motions only. Let's go to China. New cold record was just broken. Negative 53 degrees Celsius, which is negative 63 degrees Fahrenheit, breaking the previous record by a couple degrees. That is a brutal cold right there. They could really use some global warming. But the big story today was making big waves online already yesterday, that Earth's core rotation has changed. We've covered this in our show in the past and in our books, and basically, the discussion is about the rotation of the core versus the mantle. The core was thought to have a super rotation, to rotate faster than the rest of the Earth, but they're saying that shifted sometime around 2009. Now here's the caveat. Some researchers never bought the idea in the first place. Some think it switches back and forth between super rotation and sub rotation every couple decades, but now there will be extreme focus on the subject in the world of geology. They are poised to figure it out for sure. One thing we know is that changes at that level affect the rotation speed of the planet, the length of day, and most geologists believe it impacts the strength of the magnetic field and the position of the magnetic poles. From that perspective, these articles which force the field to have a greater focus on the topic should result in new revelations about all of it over the coming months and years, and given the fact that we are in a geomagnetic excursion, a magnetic pole shift right now, that is a good thing. Folks, we added another tour date to the list. At the link below the video, you can find information about the tour dates, locations, and get your tickets. This will likely be our last tour before Observer Ranch opens, and the events are all there. Again, your tickets are below the video at the link in the description box, and we also have links to our playlist, books, websites, and more. We greatly appreciate your support. Subscribe, and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, it's 5.45 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.